If you forgot your passcode on your iPhone, you cannot remember, you are punching your head, you cannot really remember what your passcode is, then you're not alone. It happens to many people, including me. Hey guys, how's it going? It's a Pocket Back Channel tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can remove the forgotten passcode on your iPhone without using iTunes. So, let's get started. There are many ways of doing this. One of them is use internal search for your key. So this software can be downloaded from the website right here, from the official Tenorshare website. And as you can see, it's available for both Windows and Mac. So if you have a Windows, then don't be disappointed. You can still try it in there. Now, before moving on, I would like to mention that any software you use, it involves removing all of your data from your iPhone. Now, this is a fact because due to Apple security, you cannot remove the password on your phone and break the password and get in. So the only way of doing this is by fully restoring your iPhone. So exactly the same as you take it out of the box. Once you reset, you can always go to iTunes and then you can re restore a backup that you may have done a while ago. And I'm gonna show you how to do this in the end of this video. Okay, so without further ado, let's get started. So make sure your iPhone is plugged into your computer. And after that, launch the reserve for your key. And before moving on, I would like to point out the warning message right here as well as says that all of your data will be removed from your iPhone, this is a fact. iOS version will be updated to the latest one, so keep that in mind. And lastly, make sure that your iPhone has enough power. So if you don't have enough power, then let it charge for a couple of minutes and then you may come back to it. Anyway, so once you're ready, hit on start. And then for, in my case, the latest version is 11.4.1, so this is going to be downloaded. So we're gonna click on download. That's going to take a while to download. So we're gonna be back as soon as the download is finished. Okay, so now the framework has been downloaded, the latest iOS version has been downloaded, and now the only thing you have to do is to click on Start Unlock. Okay, so the process of your iPhone being restored has already been started, so don't touch your iPhone, just leave it there, and then wait until the process is done. Okay, so now your iPhone is fully restored, and the only thing you have to do now is just to set it up as you did once you purchased your iPhone. So it's exactly like you took out of the box, nothing in here. Eventually, you're gonna reach to a step saying Restore from Backup. Now, depending of where you have done the backup, if it's in iCloud, then say restore from iCloud, but if it's on iTunes, then say restore from iTunes. Okay, so now let's jump straight back to my computer, to iTunes, and show you what you need to do next. Okay, so now launch iTunes. So I'm actually gonna close this uh, the software because it prevents opening at iTunes at the same time. And then you should have this screen right here. Then here it says restore from this backup. So this is the latest backup I have done, which was yesterday. So I'm gonna select that, or you can choose another one if you want. I'm going to click on continue. I'm going to type the password because I have set a password for this backup. And after that, leave your iPhone to the side. iTunes is going to do the rest of the job. And I'm going to be back as soon as the process is finished. All right, so the process is done. Back to my iPhone. So now press on the home button in order to carry on. And now it should ask you to put your passcode if you have set one. After that, you need to follow a few more steps in order to start using your iPhone. That includes putting your Apple ID, location services, privacy, and all this stuff. In the end, you are ready to use your brand new iPhone, in quotes. And that brings me to the end of this video. So thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Feel free to hit the like button if you like this video. Drop a comment, let me know down in the description what you think about this video. Did it help you out? Did you find any difficulties? Let me know in the comments and I'll do the best I can to help you out. Share this video with your friends. If you really found this helpful, you want to help other people as well. And also don't forget the most important, hit the subscribe button, you know, to stay connected and hit the notification bell right next to it in order to get notification on every upload we upload. Thanks for watching, as always, I'm going to see you in my next video.